in my case, College Pond really helped me out. Uh, there was this another girl from College Pond who was also going to UCR, and uh, they got us connected, and we managed to find another roommate through some contacts, and uh, that's how it worked out. Uh, but at the same time, I was also looking at you know there are these specific groups on Facebook. Association in terms of uh, price, if you're asking, then not really. Uh, but yeah, we did negotiate in terms of uh, the number of months for which we agreed to get into an agreement uh, with the housing society because uh, the deal is that for us the school year is only for nine months, and usually these guys have at least a twelve month of. So we just like openly basically spoke about it, and we agreed to doing it. So yeah, we shared everything like right from obviously the rent and also the utilities and. Whatever else you need, it like cooking and cleaning at home. If you want a room and like a separate washroom, then you have to pay like I think a minimum of six hundred to seven hundred dollars. So that's your rent. That takes like the maximum amount of money. And then um, utilities would take like another one fifty or even less. And then um, what else do you have? Um, uh, Books, I don't think it really costs much because usually, like everything's available online, so you have these PDF copies and stuff. Um, transport also, like if you are in Riverside and if you are a student of UCR, then uh, public transport is free for you, so that doesn't cost too much. Groceries would take another, I would say, hundred to one fifty dollars. So overall, yeah, like eight hundred dollars, you should be fine. I would say. Too soon because I mean you don't really know a lot of people there and you don't really have anything to do so you would probably end up getting bored. Uh, I reached like I think three days before my orientation and that was good enough. Like we had enough time to like settle down. The department orientation was much more specific to my program. And, you know they kind of acquainted us with what would be expect uh, through the year. And uh, and that's where you get to know, uh, you know, who is a part of your cohort, and uh, you know, you, you introduce yourself to those people. So um, I think that really helped me make uh, the friends that I have there today. So yeah, I think orientation is a very important. It ranges from twenty five to thirty five students. Then I am the only student, like only international student. Um, uh, otherwise, it's mainly like it's, it's all Americans. I think everyone um, definitely comes with some sort of a prior experience, like some work experience that is either combined with a master's degree or it is not. But uh, yeah, all of them have worked in the field. Before. Will just have uh, like these stress fairs where you know they can get like dogs on campus, or every week we'll have like free pizzas and like massages and stuff like that. So uh, I sometimes make an effort to go attend all these things. Uh, it's possible you can do it.